I'm meteorologist Wesley Williams. Welcome to your Weather on Demand for UpperMichiganSource.com. A couple of features on the national satellite map. One, of course, the big nor'easter in the northeastern United States. That's affecting them, bringing some really heavy snowfall totals to folks all across the northeast. We're hearing reports in, not sure if they're confirmed or not, of nearly a foot of snow in portions of the northeast. Meanwhile, not so snowy here in the UP, but that won't last for too long because there's another storm gathering energy out across the Gulf of Alaska, and that's going to soon move into the central portion of the United States and over the weekend develop into a really big storm that's going to bring us a lot of rain on Saturday and Sunday. Right now a weaker area of low pressure is nearby and that will uh, bring us some south wind today. We were hoping that this will be one of the sunnier days of the week and it's possible to see some sunny breaks in all of the clouds in the sky, but I wouldn't really count on it too much. There could be some isolated showers both today and tomorrow as this uh, weaker cold front moves through the area and some really cold air will start to develop behind this uh, big low that will finally move to the central plains on Saturday and we'll have the cold air moving in behind that system bringing uh, very heavy snow to the northern plains. Meanwhile, we're still out ahead of it on Saturday so we'll see warm air and thanks to a warm front probably a lot of rain showers too lingering into Sunday but then on Monday this low pressure area will slide to our northeast and looks like most of the system snow will wind up missing out on that'll head toward Ontario and we'll see lake effect snow develop off of Lake Superior thanks to all the cold air rushing in behind it. So high temperatures today, if you do see the sunny breaks, you'll likely wind up in the middle 40s. But if you stay cloudy all day, look for lower 40s for highs. On Friday, we'll have a split forecast because that colder air, slightly colder air, will be working in behind that weak cold front. So right around 40 into the middle 40s. On Saturday, though, no doubt 100% will be warmer in the UP because we have the warm front bringing in temperatures right around the 50 degree mark into the middle 50s. Now, the rain totals today will likely be very scattered. You may see some rain totals in the Keweenaw Peninsula, but those showers will likely break up before they hit the central and eastern counties, and that's mainly morning isolated showers. Forecast today as highs in the 40s, isolated showers. Overnight, it dries up, mostly cloudy conditions. Lows fall right back into the 30s, and we'll get that north wind in here, which means that Friday could feel a little bit cooler than we are today. But over the weekend, definitely warmer, especially on Veterans Day. And then the cold front rolls through, and those raindrops will change over to snowflakes in a big way on Monday and Tuesday when the high temperatures drop down into the 30s. This has been meteorologist Wesley Williams. Thanks for watching.